So recently I helped some buyers uh, purchase a home in St. Augustine. And the reason I'm mentioning this is because most buyers that I speak to have new construction communities in mind, but nine times out of 10, those new communities don't check their boxes. And it's usually because the houses are too close together and they want more privacy. So I end up showing them some more established communities in the area that I think might work better and they are always pleasantly surprised. So today I am going to take you to one of these hidden gem neighborhoods and a few things may surprise you too. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Kim Devlin with Kim Devlin Team in St. Augustine, Florida. If you want to learn more about the area, real estate, and the market, be sure to check out my other videos and subscribe to stay in the loop every week. So today we're going to take a look at a very unique neighborhood in St. Augustine, and that is Prairie Creek. When we think of St. Augustine, some of the first images in our minds are the historic downtown, the beautiful beaches, and the classic Florida neighborhoods. As we get nearer to the water, the homes tend to be closely built with smaller lots, because who needs a big backyard when you have the whole ocean to play in? But there is one neighborhood that is distinctly different from most others in the area, and that is Prairie Creek. Located less than a mile west of US-1, just off of Wildwood Drive, this gated community is one of the most sought after for buyers looking for a little bit more room to relax. This might surprise you, but almost every lot here is an acre or more. And there is an abundance of mature live oaks, cypress, and cedar trees creating a lush and shaded landscape. The natural elevation of this area creates winding streets with gentle hills, and there is plenty of wildlife thriving throughout the nature preserve that bounds the entire subdivision. So it is a much different type of neighborhood than the coastal and new construction communities that tend to be more common in Florida. Now, since St. Augustine is historic, there is some history to this neighborhood. Just about 10 feet behind a home on Red Cloud Trail was a stone monument marking the historical site of the 1823 Treaty of Moultrie Creek. It was here the most notable negotiations with the Native American chiefs and the United States military took place. And it is such a significant event that men and women traveled in small boats from St. Augustine along Moultrie Creek to the site of these talks. Now, these large tracts of land known as Moultrie Creek were purchased by a developer in the 70s, and the neighborhood as we know it today was created. The subdivision was renamed in the 80s and established as Prairie Creek. The construction of the homes in the 70s and 80s is evident in the architectural styles you can find here. There are many postmodern homes, and the large lots with spacious front and backyards were typical for the home trends at that time. You will also find traditional ranch homes, some stunning colonials, and even Tudor style. Whatever the architectural design may be, these large lots mean that most properties have pools, extensive outdoor living spaces, and gardens, and privacy. The community itself offers residents plenty of reasons to get outside. There are tennis courts, plenty of walking paths, and with only 8 miles to historic downtown St. Augustine, or 10 miles to Anastasia Island, you are never far from the events and entertainment in town. Prairie Creek is also convenient to shopping, restaurants, and the commuter connection of US-1 to I-95. Now, one of the biggest surprises about this neighborhood is the value of the properties. There's definitely a lower rate of resale here, and on average, only a few homes are sold every year. The average sale price in the last year has been about $600,000, although the listing values have ranged from $300,000 to $800,000 in the last two years. So what is so amazing about these homes' values is the acreage you get in comparison to other St. Augustine neighborhoods. Homes of similar square footage and lot size average for three million or more on Anastasia Island. Now there is a homeowners association fee here and it's based on acreage and it runs from about $120 to $260 a month. So if you're looking for a home and lifestyle that's peaceful, secure, and private, and you don't mind taking a short drive to get to the beach, Prairie Creek might be an ideal neighborhood for you. Now, if you think this neighborhood is beautiful, comment below and hit that like button. If you'd like to learn more about Prairie Creek or others like it in the area, you'll find my contact information below. As always, thanks so much for tuning in and taking this tour with me, and I'll catch you on the next one.